Can visitors in Canada get COVID vaccines? Hello everyone, welcome to Charmaine's Journal. So in today's video, I will talk about COVID vaccines for visitors in Canada. My mom is here in Canada on a super visa. Uh, super visa means that parents and grandparents can come to Canada as a visitor for three years at a time. So, so my mom is here for um, three years. I was worried at one point if she could get a uh, vaccine in Canada because she is here only as a visitor. So I checked the website, the government website, and fortunately, luckily, thank you to the government of Canada, uh, my mom is getting a COVID vaccine. And uh, of course, there's requirements. Uh, you need to show the proof of address that you're living in the, in the city or in that um, vicinity and she needs to show her passport and some sort of document that we're living in the same address. So yeah, so I am taking my mom today. I am very happy. It's the, it's Easter. There's so many things going on today. So it's Easter. It's Luna's birthday. It's my dad's birthday. And then my mom is getting a COVID vaccine. So it's either Pfizer or Moderna that she's getting. I don't know yet. So, um, yes, I am excited. Let's go take her to a COVID vaccine station in, in Canada. So we arrived at the clinic where my mom is gonna get her shot. So, um, let's go with her. I'm just gonna double mask. So we are at the clinic now and I'm with my mom. Hi mom. Hi. So my daughter. We are at the clinic and then I'm going to try to see if we can videotape the uh, whole experience. It says lineup but there's no lineup. Nobody's here. So we will we'll see how it goes. And there's and there's Plexiglass. So we're at number two. Thank you. Tom finished the vaccine and we're going out now. Ayon, tapos na po ang vaccine ni mother. Ayan. So she got a Pfizer vaccine. And unfortunately, due to uh, privacy loss, I couldn't take a photo or a video. So my mom is done her vaccine and her second schedule will be in July. Ayan po, uh, due to privacy, para marespeto yung privacy ng mga tao na nasa loob, hindi nila pinayagan na mag-video kami. Pero tapos na ang vaccine ni mother. So kamusta ang bakuna? Masakit ba? Little bit. Oh, ang galing. Masera, <laughs> 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 Ang galing mag-English ng nanay ko. Little bit daw, ah. Tagalog ko tinanong yun, ah. Sinigod ng English. So, saan mo pinalagay yung bakuna? Left side. Bakit left? Because uh, uh, my right side is uh, using for everything. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're right-handed, right? Yeah. So because she's right-handed, I I told them to just put the vaccine on the left side, so she can uh, still use her right hand for everything. So anong anong masasabi mo sa experience mo? Papasalamat ka ba? Siempre malaking bagay, malaking bagay uh, para protection. Ayan, so meron na siyang um, bakuna. Uh, masaya kami na nabakunahan siya ng Pfizer. So, Pfizer po ang vaccine niya. Tapos, babalik kami ng July for the second vaccine. So, ayun. Masayang masaya ang Easter namin. Happy Easter, everyone! Happy Easter! Bye! Keep safe! Hello, everyone. So, that was our day. I hope you liked the video. And please note, I am not an immigration expert. I am just sharing our experience, my mom's experience in taking the COVID vaccine. 
So yes, yun po ang araw namin. Alam nyo, we only have one mother. So we have to take care of our elderly parents and it's our time to give back and guide them and be there when they need us because they were there when we were little and uh, they took care of us. So it's time to take care of them. Kahit na medyo makulit. Keri lang. So yes, that's our video for today. And if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and the notification bell. Maraming salamat po. Happy birthday, Mom! I love you! We are in the province of Ontario. So... So Bay is singing. Can you sing that again? Ontario, there's no place like home. Kaling kumanta ni Bay, di ba? Ha 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 